Uh, today we're going to work on irons, okay? So, today we're going into Ian's full swing. These shots will be right off of the ground. This is going to be hard for me because I struggle hitting the ball and I usually top the ball. We're going to videotape Ian's swing and so we give him some good information from uh, which to build on going forward. All right, Ian, so what we're seeing here basically is a, is a nice uh, arm hang here. If you can see that these two arms and the shaft of this club is making what letter? V. V with the shaft extension becomes a, becomes a Y. Good. <laughs> it's actually a pretty nice job of keeping your head still like that. Yeah. However, watch what happens when you move off the ball. The problem is when you get into the ball, okay, what happens is as you start to transfer your weight, yeah. you're actually going to move up and out of your golf swing, yeah. topping the golf ball. Pretty good for a beginner, I'll tell you what, not too shabby. So he videotaped my golf swing, and right during the lesson, he emailed it right to me, so this is something I could show my friends, maybe show a couple of other people at the golf course. Now, you see this lampkin sign here? Mm -hmm. Okay, go ahead and grip the club. Okay, now what we're gonna do is we're gonna move your thumb over just a little bit, so now you can see that logo. Okay. Posture-wise, you're a big boy. How tall are you? 6'2". Six 6'2". Two. Six two. So we want to stand as close to as 6 foot as possible, maybe 5'11", something like that. Right now you're about 5'6". We don't want that either. Okay. So. And in golf, if you can maintain your posture position uh, throughout your full swing, you're probably going to be pretty successful getting the ball into the air. What you're going to do is you're going to stand as tall as you, vertical as tall as you can, okay? Okay. You're going to see that my inside of my biceps are against my body. Okay, you're going to bend from the waist first until the club touches the ground. Go ahead and do that. Now give me some knee bend here. Okay, good. Made my knees bend a little bit. Kind of look like an athlete more, a little more coordinated. The one thing you lack in your golf swing is what we call a wrist hinge. Okay, okay. go back to the ball again. Very slowly back to me. Good. Keep your head on the ball. On this swing here, I want you to hold your finished position like a statue, okay? Good. Toes up. Nice swing, buddy. Nice job. Much better. Okay? Okay, don't move. What I want you to do is take your left hand, put it on against the club on your shoulder like this. Take your right hand, do the same thing. Okay? Good. Don't move. Knee bend. Posture position. Good. Head's very, very still. The goal here is to get the burn end of this club. Back behind that ball. Don't look at anything else. Head still, turn. Look at this position here. Okay, weight's here, good. All right, head stayed on top of the ball. As we come back down to the ball, our goal is now to get the club head back to the ball. Good. Finish nice and tall. Foot like that. Okay? That, that's your drill. So we picked to uh, film this on a really hot day. Dwayne, I'm thirsty. Well, fortunately for you, check it out. How are you guys doing today? Good, Ken. What's Good. going on? Not much. What can I get for you? It's extremely hot out of here. I'm gonna go with. Uh, I'm gonna go with the water. How about you? I'm gonna get a power in. All right. All right. Hi, I'm Kendall. Um, I've been working at Honeybrook since I was 15. So that's like six years. Um, I started outside staff, now I do beverage cart. That's my main job. Um, I love working here, that's why I worked here for six years. Employees are fun, the members are fun. Um, of course I'm selling alcohol to people, so that's fun. <laughs> um, yeah, it's just it's a fun place to work. Um, I don't really want to grow up and move on because it's not going to be like this. <laughs> I'm going to miss it. <laughs> What color Powerade? Red, uh, blue, yellow. Blue, please. Blue. All right. You know what? Can I have a blue Powerade also? Yeah, sure thing. Ixnay the water. Five. Keep the change. Thanks. Thanks, Kendall. Thanks, no Kendall. No problem, guys.
Thank, uh, thankfully enough, we still have the beverage card out this time of day. It was, uh, I think it was around 90 with a 100 index real feel, so it was hot. Uh, drinks, I have beers, domestic, imported, all cans, and I have liquor, fireball, Captain Smirnoff, and then if you request something, you can just throw it on there. Um, snacks, I usually have hot dogs, and I have chips, and crackers, and power bars are on this side. Juices, sodas, water, candy bars. But like I said, if someone requests something, I'll put it on there for them. It's not a problem. I, luckily, I did have cash with me today, but uh, really the cool thing is I didn't know this, that the beverage cart now takes credit cards, and that's very, very convenient for any golfer out there. But she, uh, she was a lifesaver today with that power rate for sure. Anyway, next week we are going to, uh, after we fit Ian with the iron set uh, as well as the driver, we're actually going to have him hit his driver off the tee. The ball placement is going to be a little bit different. And uh, we're going to do another video session there and see if he, uh, after a week's worth of drills or so, he's improved some of the things that I told him or actually emailed him to work on.